If you're struggling to lose weight, the culprit might be those few extra drinks a week. You might be shocked on why this is. So if you're here for this video, the point isn't to make you feel bad about yourself or to try to get you to quit drinking. I want to give you a brief overview of the science and let you apply it in your situation for however it can help you best. Hey everyone, welcome to Science Based Fitness. I'm glad you stopped by. Today we're covering the three main reasons on why drinking alcohol can make it harder for you to try to lose weight. The first and most obvious reason is that it's excess calories. If you have one drink that's 150 to 250 calories a night, roughly we know that around 3,500 calories equals one pound. So that's an extra 1.25 to 2.25 pounds a month. And those are rough estimates, but that is a general ballpark. This calorie energy expenditure is not exclusive to just consuming alcohol. This math is the same even if it's just a candy bar you have a day, and you add that on top of your totally total daily energy expenditure. So if you're burning 2000 calories in a day and you have either an extra drink or an extra candy bar, that will be excess calories and can make it more difficult to lose weight. Beyond that first point of total calories taken in with alcohol, alcohol when ingested needs to be metabolized. The body prioritizes alcohol to be broken down first. So let's imagine that fats and carbohydrates are your body's main energy source. Those carbohydrates and fats are then stored until enough alcohol is broken down. The metabolism of alcohol can be fairly complicated and if you're interested in more on this topic, I linked a study in the description you can go ahead and read. It is pretty fascinating but it does get pretty complicated. So the body typically doesn't use one simple energy source as its main energy driver. It's usually a mixture between carbohydrates and fats. So that's where it can be detrimental when we actually start to increase the amount of alcohol being taken in. Your body can metabolize a certain amount within an hour and each person slightly different, but within that realm of possibilities, you're slowing down the body's ability to metabolize fats and carbohydrates and switching to metabolize alcohol simply because it's more of a toxin in the body. The body prioritizes removing alcohol first to restore normal functions. When it comes to lifting weights, alcohol can reduce testosterone levels, which can affect your ability to build muscle. When testosterone levels are low, weight loss can become more challenging, building muscle can be a more difficult task, along with other serious issues like metabolic disorder. If you're someone that's struggling with alcohol problems, I added a link in the description if you need help. So a brief overview here, number one, we have excess calories, two, we have the way the body metabolizes alcohol, and three, the reduction of testosterone in the disruption of hormone regulation. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video here. If you got use out of this, hit, hit like. If you guys got use out of this video, hit like, subscribe to the channel, stay tuned for my weekly content. We'll see you guys next week. If anyone's interested in helping support the channel, we now have a merch shop that's up and running. We also have an account on the site, Buy Me A Coffee, which is a way for viewers to be able to support the channel with giving a one-time donation or allowing them to become channel members for just $5 a month. Memberships unlock exclusive content, so check out that link in the description.